It's Nick Mazzini with Andy Morrison after the Nomads 3-1 victory in the Welsh Cup over Portsmouth. Andy, a good performance in the end there today? A good result, yep. Um, very, very difficult conditions, um, you know, which would suit an underdog team. Um, you know, um, it wasn't conducive to any sort of moving the ball quickly or whatever. It just made it a bit of a dog fight and, you know, we showed great character after going 1-0 down so early, you know, to a, a shocking goal again. Um, we showed great courage to get back into the game and got our noses up front and then, you know, the second half, you know, I, I give great credit to Port Malik because they came. Um, you know, they were very, they were, they were organised. They worked hard. It was a cup final for them. Um, but you know, the second half, if we sh if we're professional and we show the qualities that we should be showing, you know, that that game six, seven, eight, nine, ten, nil. Sorry, one. Or we um, at least ask questions of the keeper. You know, but we've got into the final third, and I don't know how many occasions we've just give the ball away sloppily. We've under hit a pass, we've made the wrong decisions, um, we've lacked the courage to go and stamp our identity on the game as an individual. Um, and that's the most frustrating thing for me, you know, because you know they're going to come and have a go at us, you know they're going to push on because it's a cup game and they've got to get back into it. You just show me some quality and punish them, you know, by making the right decisions. And the right decisions come from wanting the ball. When the ball drops, if you're asking for it and you're making your body shape available to receive the ball, when you receive it, you make the right decisions. If you're not asking, if you're stood waiting and then somebody having to give you the ball and then you react to that, your body shape's all wrong and you make poor decisions. You've got to get yourself out of trouble. So, you know, we've just got to show a bit more courage because when it comes to bravery and putting your neck on the line and, and tackling and heading, you know, there's, there's no team that can touch us for that because, you know, they've got fantastic uh, desire to, to not be beat. But... Equally, courage comes in the same form of wanting to be on the ball and wanting to get it in tight areas, you know, and show what a good player you are. And you know, I just thought we lacked that. Yeah, the pitch doesn't help. The pitch is appalling, you know. The pitch is really, really poor. Um, you know, this time of season it does go that way, but you know, it seems to be as bad as I've ever seen it. So we've got to deal with that, you know. And um, we'll go into Thursday night's game against Bala, you know, and the pitch is going to be more rain, the pitch is going to be as poor as that, so it's, you know, I can't see it being a very pretty game of football, you know, I'd imagine it's going to be a war on Thursday night, and, you know, if it turns into a war, then I'll always back my players. New arrival today, Johnny Spittle making his debut for the team as well, had a very good performance. Yeah, he slotted in nicely, you know, it was probably a game that was good to put him in, um, and again, you know, we done everything that we've asked of him, you know, he hasn't looked out of place, um, but, you know, I'm just saying collectively it could have been a much easier afternoon for us um, if you know if we'd made better decisions at the right times you know we could have made it a much and you know you get that third goal or I think we had a chance on 48 minutes 53 minutes 60 minutes 65 you know these are these are chances and then right at the end you know on 88 minutes we've got for four one and, and again we're not taking them um, I know and that's that's frustrating but you know we'll get better we'll get better you know we're gonna you know we'll uh, Thursday means that we'll be able to train next Saturday, so we'll be able to train Saturday, Tuesday, Thursday in preparation for the Cardiff Met away game. So we'll be able to work on things and be brighter and be better. Um, you know, so promising. I'm looking at the, the strength of the squad there. I'm looking at the players that are not involved. I'm looking at the players that are on the bench coming on. I'm thinking fantastic. You know, I've got a fantastic group there to work with going forward. Um, you know, so it's promising. But this, you know, it's. Strange one to be saying that in January you're talking about doing stuff on the training field, but you know there's there's a lot of stuff we need to improve on the training pitch. Um, you know, with new bodies coming in, I think you know we might be having another body going out this week. Um, so you know you're looking at five, six, seven players have left again mid-season. You know, so and we're bringing new players in, so it takes a bit of time for them to gel, but it's very promising.